Hi there. So today I have a challenge for you. What I want you to do is I want you to imagine your life ten times better than the way it is today. And the reason for this is because I don't want you to feel disappointed in yourself. I don't want you to continue going through your life wondering what if, you know, things were different. I don't want you to hate yourself right now. I don't want you to hate your life right now. And after you picture your life the way it could be better in the future, I want you to really examine yourself for the way that you're living your life today. I want you to really, really do some reflection on who you are at the moment. And I want you to compare, you know, the two. What's different about you today than that person that you imagine yourself to be uh, sometime down the road in the future? And when you can really come to understand the differences between yourself today and who you want to be, I think it's only then that you can finally come up with a strategy that will help you get to where you want to go. And the reason why this is important is because sometimes the reason why you might be depressed, sometimes the reasons why you might hate yourself, the reasons why you might not um, enjoy your life at the moment is because you're not doing the things that you actually want to do. You're not actually becoming the person that you want to be. And when you can see the picture of who you want to be in the future, and you can see the differences between yourself today and that person, and you know what it takes to become that person, the only thing left to do is to start taking steps in the right direction that's going to get you to that point. So this is kind of a way for you to really see exactly what's going on. And it'll also help you uh, come to realize whether or not you're setting too high of goals for yourself. I think this is one of the reasons why you might be depressed. I know this is something that happens to me is I set really high expectations for myself and when I didn't, when I didn't reach them because I really don't have what it takes, um, I ended up getting really depressed. I, I hate myself in those moments where I see something that's pretty much too good to be true and I, I really want to be this person who's you know got more money, who has more friends, who's doing a lot more things with my life and um, it just happens to be that that's unrealistic and that I should actually be happy with myself the way that I am today. So for you what I want you to do is I want you to really focus on what it is that you want and I want you to really um, think about whether it's realistic or not. And you know I, I honestly just believe that one of the things that's going to make you happy in your life, the thing that's going to possibly cure your depression if there's not something mentally wrong with you, is that you know just going through the motion of life and doing things that you enjoy, becoming that person you want to be, and having a clear goal for yourself I think is important. So uh, just remember that you know there's always a way for you to become better and that you don't have to lose hope in yourself and you don't have to quit on yourself you don't have to quit caring you don't have to hate yourself you know just keep that hope alive that's really what I want to do for you is to remember that you can take steps in the right direction you can get to where you want to go just imagine what your life can be like and I know this sounds like something you've probably heard before which is you know uh, uh, you know dream big and follow your passion and that's kind of what I'm saying here but you know I'm also saying to be realistic about this so um, hopefully uh, that makes sense to you and that's really just my challenge is for you to really write down on paper what you want it for your life and then write down what you have right now and then write down what is gonna take to do that and you have to ask yourself am I willing to sacrifice things? Am I willing to go through challenges that will um, force me to get to that point? Because here's the thing, if there is a person that you want to be, if there's something greater that you want to become and you're not there yet, there's a reason. And that reason is because you're not doing the things in order to get there. So you have to be willing to do that. And if you're not, then come to the understanding that you're not doing those things and just love yourself the way that you are today and not hold those really high expectations. So I hope that this video makes sense. I hope that this challenges you. I hope this gets you to think about 
things. And remember that it, it is going to be challenging. There are going to be failures, uh, trials and tribulations that you're going to have to go through. And, you know, as long as you're willing to face those things and not, you know, all of a sudden becoming depressed or disappointed in yourself at that time when those moments come that are challenging, then one day you're going to find yourself, you know, a lot closer to that perfect, perfect person that you want to be. Uh, I was going to say perfection. So uh, one step closer to perfection and this is, you know, just something that you have to go through. This is something you have to figure out on your own. For me, you know, I've uh, definitely um, imagined my life to be better and currently I have really high hopes for myself and this is one thing that I hope that encourages you to move forward in your life is the fact that I had this really dark time in my life where I was going through depression and um, you know I really did lose hope in myself and I just don't want you to lose hope in your life and who you can become and today um, you know I, I have come to um, the reality of the fact that I'm limited in what I can do but I'm still trying to take steps in the right direction so I hope that you do too so um, that's it for this video. I hope that you like it. I'll continue to make more videos soon. And um, I'm so glad to have you as a subscriber. And I hope that you give this video a thumbs up and just share it. Um, so just remember to imagine your life better. Take steps to get there. You know, uh, love yourself no matter what. And that's it. Just don't lose hope. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video.